Tell me why. And because they, color they, matters. They, they get it. They get it. Right there. That's why. They're the way. They're the way. They got betrayed. It looked like that. Why? Why did they betray him to be this color? You had the one that did it. I didn't do it. I'm asking you. Why did they do it? She giving you the answer. She giving you the answer because she has knowledge. But, Judy, I want you to understand because it's... No, it is. every man's got to walk his own path, right? So Look. you have to understand why they betrayed your father, he your savior, as a white man. He, he, no. he ain't that go. Because they want you to be destroyed. Julius, my name is Saul. It's a pleasure to meet you. Nice to meet Let me you. see this sign right here. If color didn't matter, then why is this in every Sunday church that you go to? Why is this in every Christian? I go. I used to go to uh, Unity Temple right down the street. You know what image of color Christ they had? This color right here. Color. If you go right down the street, hold on, hold on, hold on. Hold on. Make my color if you go color right color. down the street, color. if you go, color. Okay, color. okay, okay, Julius, Julius. Answer this, answer this question for me. Answer this question. Julian, answer don't this question. Nobody. See how you ain't answering my question? Julian, answer this question. Why is this image portrayed in every so called black church today? Come on. Well, I gotta do that. Tell, no, I'm asking you a question. Tell me why it's portrayed in all our movies today. Come on. Tell me why it's portrayed in every Facebook category we go to today. If you want to go to Facebook today and type in Jesus Christ, you're going to see a pale white, white man just like this. Tell me why this is in our church today. Tell me why this is everywhere we look today. Come on. Tell me why. Just tell me why. I just want to know why. I just want to know why. Yeah. Tell me why. And because they, color they, matters. They, they, got, they got it like that. That's why. They, 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 they the way. They the way. They got betrayed if it looked like that. Why? Why did they betray him to be this color? You had the one that did it. I didn't do it. To I'm asking you, why did they do it? I don't know. Why she gave you the answer. She gave you the answer because she has knowledge. But, Julius, I want you to understand because it's no, yeah. cause every man's got to walk his own path, right? So Look. you have to understand why they betrayed your father, he your ain't. savior, as a white man. He, he, no. he ain't that go. Because they want you to be destroyed. Oh, yes. no, they no. want you to be destroyed because yes. they want you to serve this man right Come here, out. this nation of people right here. Give me so Revelations so 1 and uh, 12. So Revelations 1 and 12. Yes, hold on, hold on, hold on one second. Hold on one second. The white people got to sell Revelations yes, 1 and 12. The book of Revelation, chapter 1 and verse 12. And I turn to see the and I turn to see verse the verse 11. Say, I am Alpha and Omega, uh -huh. the first and the last. Mm -hmm. And what thou seest, write in a book. So here it is. Christ is talking to John the Revelator right now, right? Because the book of Revelation means to reveal, right? So uh, Christ is telling John to whatever you see. Right in the book, right? Let's see what Christ, let's see what John sees. And I turn to see the voice that spake with me and being turned. So now he's turned around. Uh, you say your name is uh, Julius. Julius. Yeah. If you hear somebody say, hey, Julius behind you, what you gonna do? I don't look back. You gonna look Julius. back, right? You gonna turn yeah. around because you wanna see who's talking to you right now, right? Yeah, so right. John the Revelator is about to turn around and acknowledge the person that's talking to him, right? right. Let's see the identity of that person. Read on. And being turned, I saw seven hey, golden candlesticks. And in the midst of the seven golden candlesticks, one like to the sun, like, yeah, like unto the, the son of man, clothed with a garment. Keep reading, come on. Clothed with a garment down to the down foot. And turn about the path with a dirty, the golden truth. girdle. Because, hey, Hannah and I, y'all switch. Hey, yeah. so we're taught that Christ doesn't have a body. He's just a spirit that's floating around. But here in Revelations 1 and 13, it states that he has a girdle, right? Down to his feet, right? He's behind seven golden candlesticks. So now it's about to go even, even more detail of how Christ looks. Verse uh, 13 again. Revelations 1 and 13. All right. The book of Revelations, chapter 1 and verse 13. And in the midst of the seven candlesticks, one like unto the Son of Man, mm -hmm. clothed with a garment down to the foot. Mm -hmm. And girt about the paps with a golden girdle. Uh -huh. His head 
and his hairs were white like wool. He said it was white like wool. Now, what nation of people has woolly hair? What nation of people has woolly hair? Is it the, the Caucasian up in the Caucasus Mountains? Is it Australians that's trying to uh, taste of- uh, African America. The so-called African American. Yes. Would you agree? Yeah. You would agree? Okay, all praise. Let's keep going. And his hairs were white like wool, as white as snow. And his eyes were as a flame of fire. And his- And the Bible says his eyes was a flame of fire because why he drunk wine in moderation. Just like this young man is learning right here about the 12 tribes, Christ came from those 12 tribes, right? So we're teaching right now, sir. What's your name? Canards. We're teaching the image of Christ because a lot of people don't know. A lot of people say he didn't exist. A lot of people say he's a spirit. But God is giving a description of how Christ looked and he actually had a body, right? Let's read on. Read on. As white as snow, and his eyes were as a flame of fire, and his feet like unto fine brass. Now let me ask y'all this. I'm gonna ask all three of y'all. Hey, matter of fact, hey sis, do you mind if I use your example real quick oh, for your feet? Y'all see the sister feet right here? Do you see her feet right there? Is not her feet the same complexion as the rest of her body? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Right. right, exactly. Read that part again. And his feet like unto fine brass, as if they burn in a furnace. Hey, my man right here, my man, what is the color of brass? It's what? It's what? Green. Grand? Green. Green? No, brass. Brass. <laughs> brass. brass. Yes, brass. Like brass, brass yeah, like a penny, hey. right? Hey. It's what? Brown, brown right? Hey, uh, what's his name? Julian. Yeah, hey, what's, what's the color of brass? Uh, what's the color of brass? Brass is so, no, 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 right next to, right next to gold. It's right next to, it's a brown, it's right? Do yeah, you agree? Yeah, yeah. Okay, yeah, let's yeah, keep yeah, reading. Read yeah, that part yeah. again. And his feet like unto fine brass, as if they burn in a furnace. The Bible says as if they burn in a furnace, right? You have a girlfriend, you have a wife, how old are you? 17. Okay, let me ask you this. Has your mom ever left something in the oven for too long? She Okay, she passed. Okay, what about her auntie? Has she ever left something in the uh, oven too long? What color does it turn? It turns black, right? Would you agree if you leave something in the oven for too long, it turns black, right? Yeah, it burns, yeah. It, if it burns, right, it turns right. black. Because the Bible says it burns as if it burned in a furnace, right? Let's read on. And his voice as the sound of many waters. And his voice as the sound of many waters. So this is why it's so important that we know the depiction of Christ. Because why? Our Lord and Savior came from the tribe of Judah. Our Lord and Savior got the same blood flowing through our veins. And he only died for the 12 tribes of Israel. What club was that at? <laughs> That was admit that uh, a lot of people don't even realize they I've called her, she hasn't responded. I've called her more than a few times. But the Zulu nation, I'm like, what the hell is this? I know nobody know what I'm talking about. You'll leave me on the island by myself. I don't know what the hell Bishop's talking about. <laughs> That's what y'all do. <laughs> Didn't have to class. Yeah, I knew what you were talking about. I just don't want to be caught out there. The hell is this? Get on my damn nerves. So read that again, 31. So uh, I keep forgetting your name. I apologize. Please forgive me. Uh, you say, Julian? So, the importance of Christ, knowing the image of Christ, is knowing the importance of your father. As a matter of fact, let me ask you this. If your father, what's the, what's the nationality of your father? What's the nationality of your father? My, my, my father passed away too. I'm saying, I'm saying, but when he, when he was alive, what was his nationality? Would he be considered a so called African American? Uh, yeah, yeah. Okay. Let's say your father. What, let's say historians turned your father into a Caucasian man. Would that be right? No, nah, it wouldn't be right because that wouldn't be your father, right? No, it wouldn't, it, wouldn't, it wouldn't be right That's, because, you know, because he don't play that. Man. Yeah, hey, he don't play that. Hey, our Lord and Savior Jesus, the black Messiah, don't play that either. Right? So That's just right. like your father don't play that, our father don't play that either. That's right. And it's important, it's a very imperative that we know the true image of Christ. Because knowing, part of knowing the true image of Christ comes back to our identity. We've had identity theft. Is it good for somebody to steal your identity? Hell no. Somebody steal your identity, they steal your uh, your driver's license, they steal your uh, your money, all out your account. That's not a good thing, right? What is nation? Nation is family. Nation is community. Nation is men leading by example. Nation is women's support. Nation is children with role models. Nation is unity. Nation is you. It's nation time.
Cristo.